I read over the, the diocesan profile. Did it come out? And I read it over. Do you have it? And, um, and I was wonderfully pleased, not surprised, but wonderfully pleased to see that that's the diocese I love. And if I was a person looking at that profile, I'd say, yeah, I'd want to have a conversation with them. And so I think the priorities that are appearing there are right on target. Um, and, um, and I'm going to say this again. I mean, we all know that we are a diocese primarily of churches in small communities. And I love that piece in the profile about we, don't, we, may, we may have small communities, we don't have small ministries. I like that. I really like that. And um, but what I want to say to all of you again is this. Being a parish in a small community, and a parish it often that in reflecting that small community, um, is something you need to be able to celebrate. I still think that among us that we have a judgment put upon ourselves that says there's something wrong with us if we're small. I don't think that's true. Now, we always want to be open to being a gospel people in a way that does, in fact, build up the body of faith. And sometimes that results in numbers, sometimes not. But I hope we can continue to work on being in a place that, it's, that you can be proud of who you are, that you're smarter than what you think, <laughs> um, that you are more faithful than what you think, um, you, are, you have more resources than what you think, and, um, and it's about releasing them. And so um, I think, uh, and the other big, that goes hand in hand with that is, is um, that doesn't mean we get to stay the way we are. Because Jesus' call to us is always transformational. And so the hard work that we must continue to do, that you must continue to do, and I'll continue to try and do in other places in my ongoing ministry, which doesn't end, um, and that is uh, to continue to do the hardest work, which is the adaptive work. The adaptive work, not tweaking but the ways that we have to adapt in order to be a more faithful people, and which is what the church has been doing for 2,000 years and faith communities before then as well.